This is a spawning pair of coho salmon in Wilson Creek. Finally I'm getting some better video of the uh, spawning coho. This is a spawning pair. The one that turns on her side is the female. She's uh, trying to build a nest there. This is interesting. You can see you can see the silt. She's stirring up silt when she does that. Now they hidden on me there. They're going over and hiding in the dark there. I guess they can see me or something has scared them. They're hiding in that little dark place over there. They'll probably come out here. They come out because uh, the camera brightens it up, you know. And here they come out again. Isn't that nice? Very good. Very good. Yeah, great stuff. That's Wilson Creek. 2010. Spawning coho. I'm taking these videos for information purposes. Uh, there's a lot of the local people say, oh, there's no salmon in these creeks, and I keep telling them, yes, there are. Well, now I have proof. I'll zoom out to show the location. Whoops, out. So we'll show the location. It's uh, November 19th, 2010. About an hour ago, two hours ago, I made a video of salmon spawning in this Wilson Creek. Now, unfortunately, you can see there's been a landslide up the hill. It's just in the last two hours there's been a landslide. And it has caused the whole creek to turn this milky color. This is where they were spawning right down there. And now the whole creek is full of silt. <coughs> this is unfortunate. Um, it's uh, interesting to me scientifically because I study hydrology. And uh, so I've measured the turbidity in the creek and all these kinds of things. This is what we're seeing here is high turbidity. It's right off the scale as far as the turbidity scale goes. And it's not good for the salmon because they lay, lay their eggs and then this the silt will smother their eggs, unfortunately. This is uh, an unfortunate incident to happen right in the middle of the spawning season. Um, however, that's what happens. In the hydrology of this creek, uh, a group of us determined that it was... Uh, the hydrology was disrupted, or it's suffering from a high percent of hydrologic disruption. And when you have that, you have more silt and more landslides and higher peak flows. You have more erosion, uh, trees falling down. You have highways being washed out, people's private property being eroded, etc. So um, it's an unfortunate thing, and it's not good for the salmon. Um, however, this is what happens. This is... Uh, I've seen this happen a couple of times before in this creek, just in the last uh, five years. It happens from time to time. There's a landslide, and I, I know there's a landslide because I can see the, the color of the water, as you can see on this video as I'm recording it. And uh, I'll just turn the camera. This is Wilson Creek on the Sunshine Coast, BC, Canada. Just a couple hours ago, I was uh, making video of the spawning salmon. Got some very good video. Now this occurs, this event occurs in the creek. Just, I could go up the creek and try to find the landslide and the cause of the landslide. That would be uh, an interesting thing to do. But I'll just show the location here by turning the camera. This is the uh, Creekside Campground where I live. And you can see I'm actually in uh, Site 59 right now making this video.